Hi all, in this video we are going to see how we can create a log router or log sync in Google Cloud Console. So we will go to logging and first see if there are logs available for our GCP project. So I will navigate to cloud logging or earlier it called a stack driver. Okay, so here you can see all the logs related to project, all the operations and the application related logs in the cloud logging. So here the default filter is last one hour. So there are no logs in last one hour. So let me expand it and I'll just make it as the last six hour and see if there are any logs generated yeah so here are some rocks related to a cloud build okay so here we can see the logs now our requirement is we need to route these logs to a BigQuery table or a pub sub or a cloud storage bucket so how we can do that let's see so here we have option for logs router so I'll go to logs router and here I'll create a sync so in any project you could see there are two default syncs one named as a default and another is a required so you cannot manage this or you cannot delete or change this so you cannot delete this you able to see so all the logs are by default available in these two storage bucket so let me create sync as a pub sub so we can route all the logs in our pub sub topic so let me create a pub sub topic first so i'll create one pub sub topic so we can create a log sync to route our logs in a pub sub topic Okay, so let me go to pops up okay let me create a topic I will name it as a log sync and I will create a topic So I have clicked here add a default subscription. So it will create a subscription for this topic by default. Okay, so here a log sync is created. Let me create a router here. So let me create a sync. So I'll just give the name as demo. I'll just sync service so here are the options we have so i'm just selecting as a cloud pop sub topic and i can select the topic here as a log sync which we just created okay so here are the filters if we want to route only specific logs so currently i'm not giving any filter and i'll just create a sync Okay, our sync is created. Let me check here in log router. Yeah, so our sync is created now. Let's check in a pop sub topic if we are receiving a log. So now we won't receive the logs because of the missing permission. So we'll see what are the permissions. So first I will do some operations so it will generate a logs. So I'll just open a cloud console again and i'll just create a vm or a data set in a big query so it will generate a log so the easiest one is i'll just create one data set in big query so it will generate the log and we should be able to see that logs in pops up log sync so i'll just go here 
I'll create data set. I'll just give the name as a test data set. The location I'll keep it as a US and I'll just create a data set. So these logs entries for my operation should go to the logs and it should route to log sync pub sub topic. So let me see if here are log. So currently here are no logs. Just because the log router created one service account which should have permission to write entries in our pub sub topic. So this is the service account I just copied. Now I'll go to IAM and give the permission for the service account. So I went to IAM and I'll just check the service account. So here it won't show. So what we need to do? So this, okay. So let me go to IAM. Okay, so here you won't see the service account because it is dynamically created and so what we can do just go to the topics more action view permissions and you can add a principle here and I'll add my service account here so let me see if I type the name correctly okay so this is not correct Okay, now service account is here and I'll select a role as a pub sub publisher or a pub sub admin. So let me scroll down. Yeah, here is a pub sub admin. Let me save this. update so it's updating the policy now we'll go to log sync and we'll see if we receive any logs so currently there are no logs so I'll again perform any operation so I'll go to BigQuery so in this state data set I'll just create a table so suppose I'll create a empty table and table name I'll again give as a table one and I'll just create an empty table. So these logs should generated and we should be able to see the logs now in the pub sub topic. So the logs are being generated. So meanwhile, we just go and again delete the table to generate more entries we'll just type delete here so table will get deleted then I'll go to IAM and I'll just add a few permissions or I'll just change a permission or I'll just uh, delete this service account I'll just update role to owner for this service account for a composer. I'll just save and I refresh. So earlier you could see nothing was here. Okay, now let me see if you go to messages and just check if logs are available. So I'll just pull the messages and I'll pull it yeah and you could see the entries are available here in pop sub topic so here whatever operation we perform all entries are available here so bigquery tables dot create bigquery tables dot delete so all log entries are inserted in our pop sub topic
so we can create a log sync with a destination as a BigQuery table or a cloud storage bucket as well so we will see that in another video thank you for watching the video